a very good morning to you. I love that piece of music. Um, that's why you hear that if you if you watch regular a few times. It's lovely. Thank you very much. As are the flowers, very delicate, beautiful, fit enough for a church, for a wedding. So welcome, to, welcome to the midweek shave. I'm actually filming this at a different time than I normally do. I usually film uh, the Wednesday shave on a Tuesday evening, but um, it's actually early Tuesday morning. So because uh, we're going out, you know, we went out last night as you're watching this. <laughs> I didn't I would not have the time to so you may see a bit more a day worth of growth and the Sunday shave you may notice or may not so that's the reason anyway I hope you're okay that's the main thing and your shaves are going well I am going to use true fit and hill this is their authentic number 10 um, shaving soap you don't see a lot of this uh, good quality soap um, well, I'll show you the. I've had this a while, like that. Um, scent uh, doesn't blow me away on this. It's not nasty, but it's not. Um, it's not one of my favourites, shall we say? But it's a good quality soap. Um, can't describe the scent, really. It's a. I mean, it's not unpleasant, but it's not something I choose. I'm using the Hendrix Classics and Co. Stainless steel bowl. This is the black, matte black version. Um, so I got some in there. We're going to use this Gillette. This is the um, the flare tip, isn't it? The red. This is the most aggressive out of the coloured flare tips range. Um, it's not necessarily an aggressive razor, but it's the most aggressive out of the range. And I'm going to use this, the Feather High Stainless if uh, hold it the right way up for you and this is its third use really enjoying the feathers overhang yet to be aware of on that polish films brush so we'll wet that and we'll get going authentic number 10 probably he's been supplied to 10 downing street or something many years ago Good little bowl this. And look at that. You see that? So any shaves planned? Well today or this week? Unless you're a daily shaver like I say. And that's going to be yes isn't it? That is very, very quick. It's a very silky shaving cream, this. I don't know, do they mark it as a shaving... Yeah, shaving cream. And uh, they had the Royal Grant from the Duke of Edinburgh, which is there. Yeah, so they must have supplied his... Uh, well, True Fit and Hill, I think they supplied the palace and the royal family. Right. As the other um, Tale of Old Bond Street, I think, had Geo Trumpers. Uh, G Trumper. All right. Here we go. Don't use a lot of True Fit and Hell, but. Uh, mm. I think it's a very floral something quite flowery, powdery scent. Um, but I can't describe the scent. It's, as I say, not a not one I'd rush out and buy, but very good quality shaving cream, obviously. And it's nice to use it, isn't it? So we'll heat up the, the Gillette. Flare tip, super speed, red. So 
Here we go, first pass. It'll be time for coffee in a minute. Well, firstly, excellent uh, slickness. Lots of whiskers. That's a nice blade. You can usually feel the feather, the bullet, whenever you use it, whatever you use it in. But uh, it feels so comfortable, I should say, comfortable and precise, if that makes sense. Sometimes I get requested when I speak on a Sunday what I'm having for Sunday lunch and um, one or two people have asked under the comments in you know past videos um, I wish you'd show us where you made or how you make it or something so if anybody's interested in how I do a Sunday lunch it's only a very it's about seven minutes long I did a Sunday a roast lamb roast potatoes and I changed it from uh, goose fat to beef dripping. Um, anyway, I filmed it and it's on my other channel. So I'll put, a, uh, there is a link to my other channel in the description below. Um, so if you go to that, if you want to see that video, it's on there. Or I'll try and put a, um, towards the end, I'll put a thing up here or whatever. But um, yeah, very good slickness on that. Roast lamb, roast potato, lovely as well. Very nice. Purple stem broccoli, green beans, lascentos of gravy, and uh, really enjoyed it. And mint sauce on the lamb. As I say, don't I'm not telling everybody to go and watch it. It's only if you've ever been interested. Or you, if you've previously asked me, you know, could you show us how you do your Sunday lunch or whatever, it'd be nice to see it. It's there if you want it. Cross the growth, being aware of that overhang. Really comfortable shave. Really nice. Yeah, as I say, it's funny how the... Do you have a soap like that or a cream where you... You know, it's not unpleasant, but you're not... Um, it doesn't... How can I say? It doesn't float your boat. <laughs> the scent. But that's what's good about this hobby. You know, someone somewhere will love this, right up their street. And that's what it's all about, we're all different. We're bound not to like everything, are we? Very good slickness. As I say, quality is superb. Um, look at this. Mm. And again, this is a few years old, this uh, shaving cream. 
and it's like the day it's it was made. Very nice. So here we go against the growth Gillette, the flare tip red or red tip I should say. Performing beautifully, very efficient, very comfortable. And all helped along, of course, by the uh, by the feather blade. On its on its third use. That's coming to that's lovely. Really nice. We've been forecast maybe some snow today, so <laughs> we'll see when I look outside. Three, two, one, pick up time, baby. We've got enough snow here on the chin, you look. <laughs> Very nice shave. This is where we go at it at different angles just to get that. Absolutely stunning. So we're going to keep keep this wet when I rinse now. Because we're going to use Mr. Allen today. That's lovely. Cool water. Here we go, remember not to dry it. Yeah, not a tingle, nothing, nothing there. Uh... It's 
So while that does its magic, we'll uh, go through with you. So Gillette, as I say, flare tip, red tip, most aggressive of this range, uh, but it's not an aggressive razor. Um, very efficient. The feather blade, third use, I really enjoy these blades and that feels superb, comfortable and efficient, really nice. Um, True Fit and Hill Authentic Number 10 Shaving Cream. Superior quality, superb I should say, superior, Su well yeah, as well. superb quality, um, lathers quickly, good slickness, everything you'd want. Uh, just the scent is not my uh, my thing. It's um, as I say, it's not unpleasant, but it's just not on my radar, shall we say? <laughs> uh, but really nice, done a lovely job. Um, Polage Films brush by DS Cosmetic. There you go. Uh, Hendrix Classics and Co. Stainless steel bowl, really nice. Water to rinse, and we've just used the alum. So we will have done its thing now. I'll rinse that off. Oh, it's lovely. That wakes you up in the morning. Oh, nice. Oh, oh, oh. Right. So what we got here. So that's what we look like without anything very pleased with that. Um, so now we we'll use the well there isn't I haven't got an aftershave to match this. I'm gonna use this vintage Yardley Gold. Remember that? Yardley Gold. Oh it's, it's a classic this and it's a spray, it's one of these. <laughs> God, that's a if that's not a 1980s throwback for me, it's just... Uh, my dad wore it, didn't he? I'm sure he wore it. Not often, but he did wear it. I'm sure he did. Absolutely stunning. But we have got the matching... Um, it's a post shave cologne balm, isn't it? Post shave cologne balm, yeah. Uh, number 10, so... Oh, it's got one of these little plugs you pull out. Little details you see when it's a quality product like that. Oh, that's lovely. That is nice. Don't need a lot. Now I must put that back in because I'll forget. There you go. Make sure it's clean. And that's it. I'll leave you in peace. <laughs> Go and have a coffee now. And um, yeah, so have a great day. Great rest of the week. Uh, wherever the weather is, if it's snowing or whatever floods, there's all sorts of things happening all over the world. So the main thing to say is I hope you and your families are okay. And uh, yeah, keep shaving, keep smiling, and I'll see you on Sunday for the weekend shave. Many thanks, and bye-bye.